be spinning in the colony. You adopt it cause you will be my Oh, I'm beating your ass. <laughs> Fuck master, fuck master. Why the speed? Why the speed? I am wrong. Why the speed? No, what? Hey. No, it's okay. You have a husband. Husband, you don't. I, I, don't, I, I, don't, I don't. 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 Look, look, stop. Stop. You have a husband. job my brother we rocking with you the husband was literally physically trying to pull her away and she was fighting him so that she could be with another dude the white dude was telling her she got a husband and even her friend was trying to pull her away everybody in this situation tried to save her but the truth of the matter is cheating is a character flaw and if a cheater wants to cheat they gonna cheat jesus can't save these hoes why are you trying he catches that baseball and then turns to the group of young ladies behind him and said hey ladies would you like a ball but, and they go, oh, aren't you so sweet? But then he says, I gave her the other ball. <laughs> the problem is yeah. he's got the gamer in yeah. his glove. Got him. We fucking got him. Mmm, I love gummies. Big hug. That's a lot of meat. <laughs> I need to go back to my therapist. Goes to my parents for Thanksgiving I once. You. I wanted your back. I did everything. That's why it's always two sides to every story. Because I was on the mom's side until the dad asked her why they didn't get married. And then all of a sudden she was acting like she had amnesia. I was unfaithful a few times and ended up... Uh, mothering children from those men you what oh my god on my husband oh my um, god so you were married to your husband but you were having children with other men i was i was um and he raised them as his own oh my god and knew them to be his own until the divorce did you premeditate this or just you, all of a sudden you found out you were pregnant by somebody you were cheating with oh no it was definitely not premeditated but we weren't using protection. Um, <laughs> so it was premeditated. I didn't yeah. say like, I'm going to have sex with this man to have a baby, you know? But I mean, I guess there was nothing done to prevent it. Um, and the first man that I had the affair with first. was, is now, is now my boyfriend, um, the father of my first child, my son. And uh, he was my husband's assistant manager. You what? My fucking. I might just stay single. I don't know if I'm gonna get married. I'm, I'm, I'm happy being alone. I think I'm done. I can't. See me, I, I, I ain't putting up with all this. And that, my friend, is the quickest way to get to heaven. The craziest part about the current system is she's still gonna get half his stuff and she's not gonna get any punishment. In nature, they say the brighter the colors, the more poisonous the animal. So y'all better start looking at them signs because ain't nobody gonna say you. It's something about the bright hair, the tattoos, and the piercings that just scream red flag. Why are there women who say they go to clubs only to dance and not be approached by men? That's being a part of it. You're going outside. Like. If women don't like being approached, why not just go to gay clubs? Women go to clubs and bars to get attention from men. Why are there women-only gyms and various safe spaces, but no women-only nightclubs? Would that even make sense? I mean, isn't that the environment women complain about the most? Um, and they ha there are some like women-only clubs. But I mean, how would it make money? Who's, who's women getting to the club for free? Who's spending the money? Can we conclude why a man might have a problem with his girlfriend going out and taking a girl's night? Of course, night? yeah. I understand. Hell no, not you with your recording ass. Yo, baby, get out, you get out. He said, not you with your recording ass. That's facts, you too excited to be here. You can't wait to file a false allegation. Excuse me, uh, I'm doing a survey. I wonder if I could ask you a few questions. Yeah, it's fine. Great. Um, if you were approached in the street by a robber, do you think you'd be able to defend yourself? No. Good. Give me your money. Nope. You got me. <laughs> the top creators on OnlyFans can make anywhere from $100,000 to $5 million per year. That's $8,333 to $416,666 per month. Now, assuming the average subscription price is around $5 a month, that means there's $1,000. 666 to 83,333 virgins paying to see someone naked. Now here are the top questions I have for these people. Who the fuck are you people? 
Are you aware that porn exists? Do you know you can see most of this shit online for free? Do you know how the male mind works and that the second you see her naked, she instantly becomes 64% less attractive now that she has nothing left to offer you? And is a six month option worth it? Because I know I don't need six months, but with this option, I'd basically be saving an entire month free. It always baffles me that grown men will give their money to women that hate them when porn is free. I'd rather shit in my hands and clap than give my money to somebody who doesn't even respect me. You better go somewhere and beat your meat. So what's the fastest car you've been in before this? I was in a Rari. I've been in a Lambo. Mm. Okay. Zach, I'm feeling kind of like... Dainty? I'm, I am feeling very dainty. Yeah. But I am also feeling a little electricity between us. Oh, nice. Or well, it's one-sided, but it's fine. Oh, like, yeah, do you not like black girls? No, you. That one okay. day was yeah, like yeah. a... <laughs> You don't respect the art of drag queens. There's nothing wrong with art, Tristan. There's nothing haram or disgusting about art. I mean, look at this. <laughs> what is this? It's art. What the hell is this? Can you make that make sense to me? Yeah, you're a racist. No one's coming. No one. No one's coming to push you. No one's coming to tell you to turn the TV off. No one's coming to tell you to get out the door and exercise. Nobody's coming to tell you to apply for that job that you've always dreamt about. Nobody's coming to write the business plan for you. It's up to you. Honestly, just lock in, man. I think the biggest thing nowadays, everybody has social media and stuff and like, Sometimes you just gotta put the phone down. Sometimes you gotta figure out who you are. No more fucking around. You want your life to be better? I can't help you. Lee can't help you. Joe Rogan can't help you. Ari can't help you. God can't fucking help you. Only you can fucking help you. Grab your fucking balls, get a fucking notebook, and write down what the fuck you're gonna do this year. And this is it. You're not gonna have these problems. Fuck the drugs. Fuck the cigarettes. Fuck that dumb bitch. It all starts fucking today, all right? No more fucking excuses. That's the fucking, this is the year of the fucking soldier. Who's gonna carry the boats and the logs? Exactly, this is the year of the motherfucking warrior. Happiness is not given to you, happiness is earned. And any source of happiness you get that isn't earned is just pleasure, and pleasure is a bottomless pit. If you're unhappy about something, that's good, it's natural. It's your body telling you that you need to evolve. I mean, just think about it, if humans were happy all the time, we would still be living in mud huts. We wouldn't have air conditioning, we wouldn't have pizza in 20 minutes. All that stuff happened because somebody was unhappy about their circumstances and decided to do something about it. Let me know in the comments below if this video was a WRL and give me the HBO special. That's a helpful brother out special. Hit the like and the subscribe button for more content. Till next time.